So how do successful investors, out of the 50,000 plus stocks that are listed on share markets around the world, how do we find investments, great quality businesses that are trading at a 15, 20, 25% discount? Well, it's fairly simple when you know how. There are certain key metrics, really a rule book that we follow with respect to what we look for when looking to aim to invest. And one of the things that we wanna always make sure we're looking for are companies that have very high return on invested capital. Now the rule book that we follow, and I'm gonna take you across to the trading desk in a moment, I'm gonna walk you through an example of a company we bought in 2020. But essentially what we wanna do is make sure we understand what businesses have high returns on capital, which businesses have long histories of making profits and delivering healthy dividends to shareholders, and businesses that have extraordinarily strong balance sheets and high demand. Now, when we understand that, it essentially eliminates thousands and thousands of businesses because there are lots of businesses out there on the share market that don't make any money. What we wanna own are companies that not only make money, make high returns on capital and have high growth. We want businesses that are gonna thrive into the future. Now, back in 2020, when the pandemic hit, oil prices around the world sunk sharply. Nobody was driving, nobody was traveling, nobody was going anywhere. But I had a hunch, as many investors did, successful long-term investors did, that oil prices would thrive again. Oil demand would come back once we started to beat the pandemic. So I started to hunt down which oil businesses met the criteria and I found one. I found one that was delivering high returns on capital, a business that had an extraordinary superior competitive advantage, but the share price had absolutely been smashed at the first part of the pandemic. Let's get across to the office. I wanna introduce you to this company and share with you the process by which we took to buy the business just to help you appreciate what is it that defines a successful investor and how can you be able to earn the sorts of returns on investment that myself and my clients are making. Let's get across there now. When we're looking at businesses to own, we wanna make sure they're great quality businesses, but we're buying them at substantial discounts. Now, one of the keys to actually doing this correctly is understanding a little bit about the history of the businesses and doing the due diligence. Now, as I said a moment ago, oil prices were likely gonna recover after the pandemic. And what we've seen is oil prices go from $40 down to zero and all the way back up to 120 and for a very short period, 130 recently. Now we knew that there was one particular business in the United States that's been around for 102 years. Not many people actually know this name as a household name business, Occidental. It supplies about 1% of the world's oil. It's in the United States. They actually had a share price of around about $50 just prior to the pandemic. But at the time, they also were buying another business, another oil business called Anadarko. They spent $10 billion to buy that business and guess who they borrowed the money from? Warren Buffett. And Warren Buffett took an investment in Occidental at the same time. We discovered this. And what we also saw that the market during the pandemic, not only were all share prices going down through the pandemic when it initially hit, but oil businesses, because there was not gonna be any demand, oil businesses were plummeting, and because of the debt that Anadarko caused for Occidental, bottom line, share price dropped from 50 to $10. A wonderful business with a huge runway ahead of it to grow its earnings was trading down from 50 to 10. We bought shares in that business at $15. Currently right now, as you can see on the screen, it's trading back at $57. Guess who started buying shares in this business and just recently spent $5.1 billion buying shares in this business for a 10% stake? You guessed it, Warren Buffett. Now, we've made over 300% return on investment just from simply taking the time to do the due diligence to one, make sure we're owning a business that is a great quality global growth company, has outstanding earnings, but also it has the backing of what we would class as a super investor. These are some of the keys to success. Now I've put together a little course that shares with you a little bit more detail 
with respect to the way we go about building global growth portfolios. I think you're gonna love it. It's free to access, you can get access to it right now. There's a link around this video. And when you register for that little video series, I'll also send you an invitation to spend an hour with me live online where I can step you through some more details about how we can help you get started or potentially build your portfolio if you've already got an account, if you haven't got one, how to start to do that and start to earn really meaningful returns on investment. So go ahead, click on the link, access the video series and I'll see you there.